Hey Moon Babes, how are you? It's been so long. I miss you so much. I'm coming out of the shower. I braided my hair. I just wanted to do a video, so I decided I'm going to do a video. So no makeup, don't care. But um, we have a huge Killstar haul. While I have been away from doing these videos, I have accrued about 2G's worth of Killstar merch. So we have that much to look at. So I decided we'll probably divide it into three videos. So I'll probably do one today, one tomorrow, and then one the next day, or maybe um, one each week, something like that. Because I need to get these done before we go to the beach, because I want to take a lot of stuff with me. <laughs> so today I thought we would do home goods, accessories, and stuff that I don't try on. So it'll kind of be a whole bunch of stuff real fast that I, you know, just should kind of show you and talk about. So this was when they had the 30% off, I think, is when I got a lot of this stuff. They had so many sales, like for Memorial Day and then Goth Day and then Goth Day repeat. And I'm like, can we stop? <laughs> because I love the last three lines. They've just been really pretty. Not the last two, not the Vince Ray and the... The, the new, brand new one, The Grateful Dead, is okay, but the one that I love, the Poison and Lace, um, and then, or the, whatever it was called, and then the, the one right after that. I love those two, and then the one before the Poison was good, too, but anyway. So, the scroll, the skull and crossbones that I have the little dress. I got these little socks to wear with it during the summer with my chucks, with my black chucks. I thought that'd be a really cute little outfit. This is not part of the socks. It says life's too short for lame socks, like all of their socks say. But we can take that off. And then just see the cuteness of the little socks. Cute, cute. I love that collection. What were these even called? I think they're bad to the bone socks. I think is what they're called. Anywho, then I got this pack of face jewels, and I'll probably wear them during one of the videos. Maybe I just got them because they were like a dollar ninety-eight, and they were so cute. I needed a couple things to kind of bring my total up to get free shipping. But I like these. I've worn them on Halloween before, like the full face tattoos. And they're fun, and you can kind of pick and choose from them if you want to just wear one that day or whatever. But cute little thing. Um, and it's called the Moon Child Face Jewels in Black. They also have them in silver, but I like the black. Because, like, I might just take the little moon off and, like, wear the moon by itself. You know, you don't have to wear them all at once. That I put them old kill star patches in because I have guess what more patches. <laughs> so I got this one is the per home patch. I don't know if I have it or not. Honestly, if I do, it's in this drawer right here um, by me. But I don't know if it is. And then I got the sky kitty, sky kitty patch again. I think that's my fourth one. But I'm so scared they're gonna sell out and I'm not gonna have them for things I need, like if I want to put them on a pair of pants, I don't know. They're just cute. I have a jean jacket that has one on it, and so does my daughter, <laughs> but still. So next, I got the moon that they have, like their signature um, moon jewelry. Um, I've tried to find stuff similar, like even these earrings I've got on right now, and I just don't like, I just don't think they're cute as cute. They just look... They're bigger, they just look higher quality, and you can't find them, like, you can't find them this size. It's really hard to find them, and when you do, they're about the same price, so why not just get them with your Killstar, Killstar order, right? So, they're wrapped in this crazy plastic. It's very protective. I'm not going to put them on. I'll probably wear them next video with the necklace, but there's the earring. There's the other one. And then the necklace. And that's the Luna. 
Oh, I like the chain. Oh, my little chain has kill star and it's protected. It's cute. So it's just a plain moon. And I love that it goes over the head. I love over the head stuff. So the necklace is for perfect length. And then the little earrings just be perfect. And they're so lightweight. I was worried these were gonna be heavy. Now, next pair might be heavy. Trying to keep my trash in check today. Wrong one place. <laughs> so I got this one. It's called the Cairo Cairo Terra Cairo Terra necklace. Or it looks like chiropractor to me, but I know that's not what it says. But it must be something that must be important. That's really cool. I love it because you know I love bats. I'm obsessed with bats. There. One of my favorite animals, flying mammal. How cool it can, you know, can't be cooler than that. I wish I could fly. I'm a mammal, I can't fly. But there's the bat and the moon. And then of course the earrings to match because how can you get the necklace and not the earrings? And these are interesting because they are not um, like a fish hook there. The little, with the little butt on um, back that goes on them just straight so that's cool and they got the little emblem and they're very high quality look how nicely made they are there's the back the front and they're really light and I love that because I hate earrings that are tight kind of wish they were dangly but I'm cool with that they're cute so I'll probably wear one one video and one the other but I definitely wanted to open those because we're going to the beach soon. Don't know what beach. We haven't decided for sure. We thought about Siesta Key, Florida. We've um, had some friends that took their honeymoon down there and said it was the most beautiful water they'd ever seen. But have they been to Aruba, St. Lucia, you know, um, Grenada, Bahamas, all those places? Have they been there? You know, and if they have, then they may not say that about the water. And I'm a critical person about beaches just because I'm spoiled after you know two trips to Aruba and a trip every year to an island it'll do that to you but um, we haven't taken our daughter but we took her to any beach except for here in North Florida so we were thinking South Florida or maybe trying the Gulf side all right I've got the coffin shelf that I'm trying to get out of the box not be cool. I'm like really having a work here. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> okay. This is cute. So the back says haunted homeware. I honestly thought this was going to be bigger, but I'm okay with it. I know what I can put up there. I got an idea of some stuff I can put up there, but there it is. A little shelf. And it's perfect in this room as you know this is this room is completely half of the stuff in here over half is kill star so if you want to um check out that video i'll link it below but i turned this room into a kill star crypt so this belongs and i think i'm going to get i don't know if i want to get the star and just turn it right side up or if i want to get the um goodness where's the star and the What's the other one that I like? I like the mirror that looks like a moon, but the shelf, the star, and then I can't remember a triangle or something, something, I th but I just thought it was cute and that it would go well with the decor in here. Is it, maybe it's a moon. Why can't I remember? I, go, I just go to that side way too much. All right, let's see. So next, I took this stuff out already to save time because we're just gonna gonna run through it i'm not gonna do any try-ons today because i got like three pieces of swimwear and other stuff in this huge box guys this box is huge it's like i could probably fit in it and this is just one and i have about five of these around my house it's crazy. I'm so ready to put them to the recycling center and out of my house. 
So this is the Nyla backpack. I went ahead and took everything off because I just wanted you to see how gorgeous. I'm gonna put my Casey Coffin wallet in here and my cell phone probably in the front pocket. It's got pocket, pocket, pocket. The inside's huge. You could actually use this for school, like for books and stuff. Notebooks at least. And like pens and stuff, but it's pretty big. So, Nyla backpack. And it has the patent leather straps on the back, a zipper compartment. For like stuff you really don't want anybody to mess with because it's on your back and this goes all the way down like almost to the bottom you can put whatever in there a lot of people carry crystals with them you carry it there it's going to be almost touching your body the whole time you're wearing this so that's that would be a great like great place to put crystals if you use them for therapy or whatever but they're so cute the little straps i just love this i'm gonna start using it as asap probably tomorrow all right, let's see. So this, guys, and you guys know I don't try on anything that shows my body. Y'all were lucky I tried on my bathing suit that time with a cover-up and the time I tried on the, um, geez, the workout with the bodysuit under it. And I thought about doing workout videos comment below if you would watch it if I did like because before I um, had my wedding like this part of fat flab right under your armpit that you hate it's in the front and the back I have actually exercises that will make that go almost away in like 30 days or less um, and I was gonna share those and there's a couple more let me know if you'd wear them I mean wear them I just looked and realized I was wearing that <laughs> let me know if you would watch them if I put if I made those videos so basically, if you'd like to see me make a full out of myself, just let me know and I'll do it. So I'm not going to take that off because it requires too fast in it and I don't want to right now because I'm lazy. So this is the bra. This is the She's Poison bra. And it's got like a thing. I don't know when I'll ever wear this. I probably won't. But this will go around the neck. And then the rest, there's like a part that goes in the front. But the reason I thought it was so cute is if you look, it has a little moon dangly hanging from the front. And I love the little moon dangly. And the models look so pretty wearing this stuff, right? And then you put it on and you're like, ugh. But the little moon, see that? That's basically why I got this entire set of lingerie. Because I don't really wear it. I wear my same comfy stuff all the time. Because don't we all, ladies? That's what we wear. What's comfy? Because that's what's important, it's comfort. And they're, they're underpants. I won't say so for their bras as much, but they're a little underpants. Most of them, the ones that are like this, that are just normal, you know, underpants are really comfy. So these are the She's Poison Panties. They have the same little move, uh, little moon hanging there, moving around. Really cute little set. Okay, so I got some random stuff. This little bat. This is the new air freshener. <laughs> it's adorable. It's the second bat I have. I have the other bat that's upside down. But now I have this one for my new car. It's so cute. My husband takes my Killstar air fresheners down while he's driving my car, and I don't understand. I think they like anything hanging from the roof gets on his nerves, but I get so annoyed. I'm like, Just leave it alone. It's mine. But he did pay for half of the car, so. So much. Mouth flows about it and just not care. All right, this is the Chitulu. Pretty sure, yeah, Chitulu two piece. I did not get this one open because I did not realize that I had it even. I forgot that I even ordered it when I looked in a bag up here. There it was. And I was like, oh my gosh. I ordered three swimsuits, not just two. But that's fine. I'm excited to try them on later because I haven't tried them on at all because I just got them today so this one is really cute it goes around the neck and then there's the top and then it's got the moon and it's like a velveteen um, the padding is not too thick it's a perfect size it's removable it's got the little pocket there that you can take it out but the print is so cute it's a 
and I think I had to order this from um, the UK site along with a couple other things because they were sold out on the, you on the, um, the American site and I had to have um, one certain thing that I'll show you in just a second so that's the bottoms I really like the way that light makes the pattern look I haven't even really seen the pattern until I can get that light on it it's really cute soft hope it looks good it's an xl if you're wondering what size swimwear i get which if you follow me you know i get an xl now this my husband and i were tripping our anniversary was yesterday and my my daughter has been having a sleepover at grandma's last night and tonight and of course it's only her second time away from home and we're kind of heartbroken so i'm up here at midnight doing a video instead of sitting on the couch because if anything comes on with a baby on it or a kid or even a mom i'm gonna start bawling so anyway, I thought I'd do that, but I showed him the bottoms of this swimsuit, and I'm not hating on Killstar. I love you, Killstar. If you see any of my videos, you know that I love you, and if you recognize my email address, you know I spend half of my check on you every week. <laughs> but the bottoms of this swimsuit remind us of like a biker um, who's like in a Speedo or something, but this is the Blaze two-piece. And my husband and I said it was, <laughs> it was like a bike around a speedo. But the little chains do come off. They got the little, like little keyhole things. And then the little, um, I'm not going to take them off. Yeah, I can. It just comes off like that. I got to get my nails done tomorrow because I broke them off doing some stuff. And I am not good without nails. Here's the top of the blaze. Let's see how it goes. This goes around your neck. And it kind of, yeah. That goes around your neck, and then there's the middle. And then the back is kind of really cool because it's like a double back. Their swimwear is adorable. The models are so pretty. All, all of their models are beautiful. And their new plus size models are so pretty. Because they used to have like the, um, the same plus size model. The same black model. And then two white models. And now they have like just an array of people. Okay. I already took the items out of these boxes for you guys. So we don't have to wait. So this is the baddie vase. And I actually have it over here on the other side of the room. For some silly reason. box all right so we got that the baddie vase i'm about to fall over as usual the baddie vase there's a little bat hanging out there got the bat there the moon there here's the little hole where your um flowers go and then we got the bottom that's got kill star and then the back has a little bat by himself and isn't that adorable this is one of their new homeware items, and it is just so stinking cute. I got it to put flowers in, in this room, so I have two kind of vases. One is a like a cup that I use for a vase. That's Killstar, but that's an actual vase. So I'm excited to put some flowers in it because I love flowers in the spring. Wildflowers, any kind of flowers, really. Okay, this is the ceramic key bowl. And I magically took it out of the box that fast. I've got to fix this chair, guys. Okay. Here's the little bowl. And it's got little paws there. Sweet little kitty face. A bowl. And a little tail. And this bowl is like 25 bucks. So, I doubt you would use it for a cereal bowl. So, I'm using it. I'm going to use it as a candy dish on my kitchen counter with a couple other things I got. So, love that. Come back in the box because I'm taking it downstairs with me. Okay, the next one is the Feline Cute Hinged Ceramic Jar. So it's basically, that was that loud, I'm sorry. Sorry if you're wearing earphones. That's what this is. And here's the little hinge. Well, I guess the hinge is here. There's the little, the little opening thing. And then it's got lots of room in there for cookies. And it's so adorable. I love cats. And I finally am going to do my kitchen and cats. I've had several little themes. And I 
just all this stuff and I thought, you know, I'll use a few of those things and make it into a little kitty kitchen. Because you spent a lot of time in there, right? Okay, this is my favorite home good type thing that I got. It's an oil burner. So you put the little candle down in there and then the oil up top, any kind of like aromatherapy oil, essential oil, kind of has a little well to go down in there. And then you light up a little tea light and sticks in there like a jack-o'-lantern. And there he goes. I think I actually have, I brought a tea light up here. There we go. Don't have, I didn't bring any oil up here, but you would put the oil in the top. And then the little flame is inside. You can see it there and it gets hot. And it's just a cute little thing. I know my daughter, when she gets home, she's going to say, look, a jack-o'-lantern, Mommy. <laughs> say, don't touch that jack-o'-lantern, which she knows better, but, you know, we got to tell them, right? Okay, I think that's all my home goods. One, two, three, four. Yeah. Okay. Now for... What else did I have, guys? I did the one, two swimsuits. Here we go. Yeah. Oh, okay, here we go. <laughs> Last thing. For this haul today. I'm trying to remember what I did with my other swimsuit. I bet I left it downstairs. I'll show you two next time. But I have this and then I have one more thing. I've been looking at this hat. Probably they've had it for a year. I've been looking at it forever. I love this hat. This is, I think it's the Orbit. Yeah, the Orbit Sun Hat. Orbit Sun Hat. And. <laughs> it's huge. Oh my gosh. How does it go to not cover your whole head? There's, I guess it's the back. Tags in the way. Oh my gosh. Oh. Anyway, so here's this hat. I guess I will be like not getting any sun on my face. I don't know, y'all. I might send this hat back. I don't know. <laughs> I like it. It might look different with the swimsuit. But that's the Orbit Sun hat. So if you want to order the Orbit Sun hat, it's not um small. <laughs> it orbits your entire existence. But yeah, that's <laughs> really big. <laughs> okay, next. And finally, I think this is finally for this one, guys. I have this suitcase. Um, I went ahead and took it out. I didn't take this part off. But this is the um, casket coffin case. And it rolls. It's got Killstar on the bag, but also on the um, zippier, the zippy tags, whatever they're called. And I think this is a carry-on size. It looks like it's already got a dent in it. I'm gonna send them a picture of that. But because this thing was like a hundred bucks on the UK site, so that would be like one thirty here. So it was like hundred thirty dollars when I bought. So it's got the little thing to keep the clothes in, and then a little pocket over here to put, you know, grip shoes in. I like to put shoes and stuff in that kind of pocket so it doesn't touch anything else. And then um, this moves out. And then you have a compartment inside of there. And then inside of there, my goodness, there's a zipper that leads to the outside of the bag. So you could like, put dirty clothes in there um, as you dirty them, you know, just put them in there and not even have to worry about looking at them. That's cool. I like that feature, but I don't like that this bag, as expensive as it was, already has it marked on it. So I'm going to be contacting them because usually when I do that, they send me a free one. I could use two of them because it's not just big enough for my stuff. Now, 
since I have been gone for so long, okay, my birthday was May 31st. I turned the big 4-0, for those that don't know. Um, yes, I'm old. Shut up. But, I got this as a gift, okay? It's an authentic coach purse. It's not a rip-off. It's even got the tags still on it. With the price, it was, they got it on sale. It looks like it came from Belks. Um, look, they got it on sale for $222. And I am going to give this away to the sub that shares my channel the most times on social media. And I'm going to go by, work by Scout's Honor. Okay, I'm not going to go behind, double check behind you and um, be like that. I'm going to trust you because I am a trusting person. Okay, and a lot of you have received gifts from me already. You know I'm going to do what I say I'm going to do. Oh, and this has a matching wallet with it. It's still got the stuff in it. It's never been open, and it's not my style. Like, I, it used to be, sort of. It's got this wallet that matches perfectly wrapped up in, in there. And the wallet probably costs separate. I don't see a tag on the wallet. Yeah, there's the tag in the wallet. The wallet was $166, okay? And it's pink inside. So I'm gonna give this away to the person that shares my channel the most times on social media, okay? I lost um, through whatever, uh, the thing that happened to me, I don't wanna talk about it because it's just silly, but um, I made, my made a decision on my own that I would just didn't even feel like posting. Um, took the joy out of my video out of me posting videos basically my kill star videos so i stopped doing that for a while and um during that time i lost probably three to four hundred subscribers i guess because they thought i wasn't putting out content or the content i was putting out was so different and boring especially compared to people who like haul videos and shopping stuff so those of you that stuck around thank you for sticking around and to show you that I love you, I thought I would give that bag away because I know there are a lot of people that like that would like to have that bag. If nothing else, you can sell it, sell the bag in the wallet for 200 bucks, which I could do too, but I'm not going to do it. I'm going to give it to you guys. So let me know. I also have a Killstar giveaway for the next video, and then the video after that, I have another Killstar giveaway. So I have three giveaways. Maybe the third video, I'll have two Things that I want to give away because I have two that I'm not going to use because I have three of something kill star so I'm gonna do that do one video one giveaway one giveaway and then the third video two giveaways so stay um tuned for that and that's all up those are all the updates that I have I think that's all I have to say except for I'm so glad I did a video I feel happy I feel back I feel me again because it, it, I've been doing this every week since October, sometimes two and three times a week. And it was recommended to me by my doctor that I do this as a creative outlet, you know. So people that have problems with that, you know, I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry that, that I'm offensive, you know, or whatever is the problem. I, I don't understand. But anyway, I'm going to shut my mouth because I'm done with that. But um, that's all I have, guys. I think um, I hope you enjoyed watching me disappear under that giant hat. But remember, stay you, stay true, stay amazing, and stay crazy. And I'll see you in a day or two. Bye, moon babes.